Hello, this is Ian again, and we're looking at the third part of profiling your scanner. Um, here, what I've done is I've uh, created my uh, TIFF target by, by scanning it as a raw scan, and I've obviously extended the range by 12 points using levels. And here I've got my reference data for my hatch color target, mine's called 6618. And the important bit I want to show you here, uh, you might be using a different version of profiling software, is I'm using a large uh, profile which gives me slightly more accurate colours and the rendering intent I've got a choice of a paper coloured grey or a neutral grey now this is you know this isn't available in a lot of software and it's the reason that I chose profile maker is by using a neutral grey rendering intent I get a far more accurate image than I am using a paper grey and that's the simple part of uh, creating a profile um, I'm then gonna start that and save it out and obviously it's gonna uh, live in the profile section of my computer um, you might also want to make different variations of your original. You might want to make, a, I've got here a plus 12, I can make a plus 14, plus 18. Just try different permutations uh, because you might need it on different images for different things. Okay, so that uh, ends the profile maker section of making your profile. After you've made it, uh, we're now going to look at um, assigning and converting the image uh, in Photoshop.